Well, there's clearly just been quite a long debrief in the dressing room there. What has just been said by De Zerbe? Uh Well, basically, uh, you can learn more from defeats than from the wins. And I think this is one of those games where you need to learn from uh, loads of things. You can see where Roma is just a bit further in those in those details. They played loads of Europa League European games, and um, we obviously didn't. Um, but it's just a bit new for us. But uh, yeah, we need to learn from it and take the the positives. Do you think it was the experience between the two sides tonight that ultimately cost? Uh, yes and no. To be honest, we were not ourselves. We were not playing our our style what we what we normally do. Uh, so that was a bit. Disappointed, I would say, from outside, but uh, you do see in some details and experience, like with playing with the ref, those kind of things, you can see that they are quite experienced here. Yeah. You said you're not playing how you feel you should play. Is that due to, I don't know, like fatigue, so many games, or is it the way Roma set up tonight that it was just purely about this game? No, no, you do hear a lot about injuries and, and those kind of things, but we do have a squad uh, which, like, Cover said it as well after the, after the game. Like everybody can play first eleven, so it doesn't matter who is playing. We want to play the, our style, and uh, yeah, it's also uh, credits to the to the opponent. Obviously, do not let them or let us into the play our uh, play our style. So credits to them, but uh, yeah, we want more. We look in the mirror and not to the opponent. So we know we have to do better. The goal, the way the goals were conceded tonight. What's your assessment of that? Uh, whew, let me let me see. Uh, yeah, a couple of errors I would say uh, unnecessary. I would say uh, again, 4-0 is, is too much. We know that, especially when you have second leg to to play. Um, so a couple of unnecessary goals uh, concede. But um, yeah, again, you can see the experience as well from their side. Uh, so yeah, again, credits to them. You did have chances though. Danny Welbeck had a couple of really good efforts. There was a shot that came off the post as well. Potentially, if they'd have gone in, it could have gone a different way. That's that's how close it is. I think in in those kind of games, like uh, yeah, like you said, Adingra hit hit the post. Uh, Danny had a, gr a good header. The keeper had an amazing save. So yeah, before you know, you can also be like two two one in front. Um, which was not a case, and then you concede for four times was a bit too much, but uh, yeah, that's how close it is, right? How do you pick yourselves up from this? That's the nicest thing of football. You get a sort of a revenge game uh, on Sunday. That's how quick it goes, and I think it's we were quite happy that we have a game on Sunday and not have to wait for a week. So uh, yeah, we have to prepare and get ready for Sunday. Yeah. And look, 4 nils tough. But is belief there that maybe you can do this? 100%, and uh, if we don't have a belief, then yeah just stay home I would say so yeah we need to go there to to, to win and uh, been crazy games in the history of Euro Europe so uh, yeah why not but you know real realistic small chance but you never know all right. thanks for your time appreciate right. it okay all right